on the mat, in the stands, having some fun in 184, no different All-American Taylor Vince going up against the newcomer, true freshman Abe Assad. The red shirt came off. It looks like they're settling in on Abe Assad out of Glenbard North, Carroll Stream, Illinois, as their 180. 84 pounder is you're looking at him Taylor Vins there all America's a freshman not last year this guy's had some big wins great opportunity for both wrestlers here well Abe Asad's uh, first opportunity to wrestle on Carver and of course since he's taken his red shirt off looks like Tom Brands put all the chips in the middle that doesn't mean that the other guys that are 84 may not be the guy later on but uh, it looks pretty good and he wouldn't I don't think Tom would uh, take the red shirt off if that you know wasn't a, it didn't feel like he was the best guy to, going forward here for this team forward pressure hips down right up and down Assad, a two-time state champion also cadet world team and bronze medalist a national junior freestyle champion and was just in high school last year yeah what here I, he is what i like tim when i see from him is his, his uh, finishes i mean he's a lot like camera like like you know the bull and young and they, they, they just good finishers keep everything tight they don't lose, lose position if they, you know, they might end up being a stalemate, but they're not, the other guy's not going to score off the shots. And Benz is interesting to me. He's a good mat wrestler. He, you know, really difficult guy to ride. Fingers There's usually about fingers. four or five reversals in all of his matches. And he can find the, his opponent's yes. back on the mat there. He's... Ooh, Whoa, a headlock and roll through. through by Benz. The, the, and the Benz. it looks like the takedown will be the Huskers out front, 2 0. Yep, nice job there by Benz, basically with the roll through on the headlock. Careful with that knee there, but uh, Benz, I think, is in position here to go ahead and climb back up on top. And now he's going ahead and see how work right there. Right, went off the mat. Take a look at this takedown here. This is Assad's attempt here. Feels that headlock, but Benz does a nice job of rolling through and comes right up and control, controls the leg and reaches for a half Nelson. Weight on the Ted hands, Green, collects red. the two. Dave Assad wanted to bring his fans to their feet in a fabulous way there, but Benz feels it comes through, and Assad just didn't get his hips down as an anchor soon enough, rolled through, as you explained there, and Taylor Benz gets the two-point takedown. And here's what I like to see when I'm looking at a freshman coming out. I go, what, what does he do when the guy's on the right-hand side? So he did a nice little change over there that got Benz over on the left-hand side, then he comes up and gets the escape. So good changeover. He may not be the guy, the best at the right hand side, but he was able to change opponent over to the left hand side, get the escape. Yes, sir. Quick escape for Abe Assad, the true Keep freshman, already going. ranked number ten as he enters the Iowa Hawkeye lineup. They've had 384 pounders ranked this year, and it looks like Abe Assad with a red shirt ear coming off is the man for the hour for the Hawkeyes as they head towards the conference in the NCAA's. Taylor Vince, only a junior. He was a two-time state champion out of Farmington, Minnesota. 2018 All-American as a freshman. Look for the side to go ahead and maybe attack that right leg that has the uh, ankle band on it. Likes the little head to the outside shot right there. Let's take a look at this escape. It's pretty important here. See how he's on the right-hand side, Benz is. But look at the changeover attempt. Now he gets him over on the left-hand side, okay? And when he gets over on the left-hand side, now he hits a little switch, a little stand-up right there. Much more comfortable, so good changeover, good sequence there for the freshman. Nice. Matt Savvy by the true freshman, Abe Assad. Starts on top here. Benz with the opportunity to get his own quick escape, which would be huge. Yeah, he's riding over there on the right side. Good look in the background of the uh, oh, nice the escape there. Peek out there with that head post. See all the sorns and strong bandanas on his teammates, former teammates, as they have done this year. The Iowa Hawkeyes uh, coming to the uh, be the top cheerleaders for their teammates after they're done wrestling. So it's just a. Neat team camaraderie seen by the Hawkeyes this year, ranked number one, undefeated. And this is where Assad has really been impressive so far with attacking that.
single-legged attempt right here. He's going to get that arm across, the right hand across. Now he's in a situation where he might be able to get back points. Ben's climbing back into it, but now he's got to try to elevate that bottom leg and get a half Nelson maybe and see if he can turn him. Put Ben's in a bad way right there. Work through it, gentlemen, work through it. Just the feel of what's happening for Abasad has to be a big deal for him right where he's at in his first outing at Carver Hawkeye. Well, there's excellent finish there, Tim. You know, got to the leg. Kind of almost had to take two bites of the apple right there to get the shot off, but then once he got into the leg, it, excellent at finishing. Short time in the second period, it's three to three. There's no riding time of any significance. Big Matt return by the freshman for the Hawkeyes. Take a look at this finish. Right. See how he elevates that bottom leg. When you elevate the bottom leg after that, that's that's if you can focus on that, maybe even get elbow deep with that, maybe work a half. If Second you can turn the hips, the shoulders will follow, but good strategy by Assad. And there's a good shot of Spencer Lee right there, leading the charge. That's what he does. He gets it, he gets it all started at 125, and he comes out and probably exerts more energy as a cheerleader than he does in his matches. <laughs> think about that for a second, what you just said. <laughs> How great would life be in a college campus if that was the case? Minute and a half left in the third period. Assad out in front, four to three. No riding time involved here. Taylor now, Vance from the Huskers needs fingers. to get in on those legs. Well, if you take a look at what's his strategy to be able to do that. And right now you can see where Assad has really kind of clamped it down a little bit. Kept him out front, working this head front headlock position. Notice how he's dropping his elbows down. Now he's in a position to go ahead and circle around. He's got the ankle. And he's got the cloud. See, as he's clamping that ankle down, or that, that elbow down, trying to scoop up. He's got to be careful not to get stepped over here by Benz. He's awful dangerous. The big scoop right there collects it. There's a two with 45 seconds left. But did you see how it, when they're both on the feet, he dropped his elbows down. He really, it's going to be very difficult to uh, take down when he's trying to hold the lead. Ben's coming right back. He's got an opportunity for a reversal. And that's what he needs, but Assad wisely gives the escape. Makes it six to four. Takedown will tie it. No riding time advantage. Ben's needs a takedown to go to overtime. Nice job of squaring up there, Tim. Now inside trip attempt. And Assad driving that shoulder into the outside of the thigh. Yeah, welcome to Carver Hawkeye Arena, Ava Saad. The fans love you. You think Tom Brands knows what he's doing? Like you said, through the chips in the middle, he said Ava Saad's our man. Comes out, beats an All-American in his debut at Carver Hawkeye Arena. Ava Saad, winner by decision.